Easy no, no need to go down. Easy no, no need to go down. Rock that run, that this how we from. Easy no, no need. Hey YouTube, it's Alady Pod, and I found the solution for the GPS phone thing. Um, in this tutorial, you're gonna get the 6.0.5 uh, GPS phone for free. Um, thanks to this guy. Check him out. He's the one who was great enough to upload the um, file and show you how to do it. Uh, check out his channel, it'll be in the description. The only problem is that when you open up, the GPS phone does load, but the only problem is that when you open up a ROM, uh, the GB BIOS is not in there. So this is my version of the tutorial. I'll give you a source for the tutorial and I'll give you a uh, the same source for the ROMs. All right. So once you have that, you win SCP. If you do not know how to use that, check out my video how to do that. Um, that's open SSHing, and you're going to need to download GPS phone that DEV. All right. Quick download right there. Once you're there, once you have everything, you go to win SCP, and you're going to open up to this uh, page. If you're not on this page for some reason. You go to the forward slash, you go to var, and you go to root. And you're going to go to this page, alright? Once you're in this page, you're going to go to your media. Once you're in this media, you're going to right click. It's going to be empty. You're going to right click, click new, and then directory. And you're going to call it Cydia, alright? With a capital C, lowercase letters like that, alright? And you click OK. Once you have that, you open up your Cydia folder. It's going to be empty again. You're going to right click same thing make a new directory and you're going to call it auto install with the correct um, capitalizations and all that stuff so it's going to be auto install right like that I'll put it in the description if I have to or something and you click OK once you do that you go to your auto install and then it's going to be empty alright uh, the weird thing is when you drag this you're going to need to drag your GPS phone or copy it in and click copy and the weird thing is, is that you're going to have to replace it even though there's nothing in there. But just click yes to all, alright? And it shouldn't take too long. Alright, real quick. And after this, that's all. You, you can close this out. Terminate sessions. Okay, there you go. Once you have that, I'm going to unplug this. You're going to have to uh, reboot your iPod Touch two times, guys. Two times. Alright, so I'm going to pause the camera and um, I'm going to do that. Alright, so hold on one second. Alright guys, it finished rebooting. I rebooted two times. I op I closed it, open it, close it, open it. And um, yeah, the, so I rebooted two times. And right there, that's the icon. And before we even start, if you don't have the GBA BIOS that does not work, uh, we're going to go to your city and we're going to add a source that uh, includes the uh, extra ROMs for you to download and... Um, the GBA BIOS. I already have the GBA BIOS installed. I'm going to give you the source. And this is the source right here. And on, instead of, I'm just going to add it again. It'll be GBA. One second. GBA dot iRom repo dot com forward slash. Alright? be in the description also. I'm also going to include the uh, Super Nintendo one. Um, since I already have it, it's going to say update. Yours should say download. Shouldn't take too long. Like I said, it includes the GB BIOS, a correct working one, and the uh, ROMs. Alright, so let's reload the data. Okay, return to Cydia. They also include, um, they also have other uh, sources for Super Nintendo and all that stuff. I'll give you the link. There's so many links. And, um, yeah, I already have the GBA BIOS installed, so we're going to search it. So I just click GBA BIOS, space, like that. I already have installed. Obviously, I have installed, like I just said, like a million times. Um, yours is going to say, um, uh, install or modify if you don't have, if you have it. But if it says install, you install, confirm, so on and so forth. They might have an advertisement page pop up. Easy download. And also, before I, uh... Exit Cydia. Uh, they have their own section with I uh, ROM GBA with many games. Most of them are popular uh, games that were played before. They're separate. They're not in bundles. Um, also, for proof that I have GPS uh, actually in my iPod, and Cydia thinks that I have it. Well, th I do have it, but Cydia thinks I've downloaded it from them. Well, actually, well, anyway, it's in blue. That's my installed stuff. 
and uh, yeah, we're going to test it out. Alright, and let's see, this is the GPS phone. For proof, they have skins, saves, recent, all that stuff. So we're going to open up the game that I recently downloaded. And uh, yeah, there you go, it should work. And there you go, Jurassic Park. And also guys, um, um, it, uh, you're still going to be able to add ROM straight from your computer to the same folder. I think it's uh, var mobile media. And then you make a new folder ROMs and then GBA and you still could put your ROMs there. So anyway guys, I'm done. I hope this helped you guys. Comment, rate, subscribe, and favorite. Five stars. If you need help, just ask and I will try to help you. I'm not a coder, but I will try to find a solution. Alright, bye.